we have the Ace of Pentacles energy here. Let me get something with the Ace of Pentacles. This could be a new resource, a new offer, a new job. Let me get something here. We got the lovers here. Okay, Gemini energy, a new partnership, a new contract. Okay, a new relationship, a new level of the relationship, a new level of balance. Oh shit, we got the Ten of Swords here. So something has is being canceled, something is being cut. Okay, wait a minute. And then we got the Seven of Pentacles here. Hmm. Okay, what is this Ten of Swords here? It's like... Okay, let me get something with this Seven of Pentacles. And now we got the Nine of Wands energy. What is this? It's like cutting off some type of relationship. Like how I said, oh, this looks like a contract and it's new and it's a relationship or something that is being offered. It's like, it's like Ten of Swords, like something, I don't know if something changed here, but Seven of Pentacles is someone that's like trying to work towards something, but they're blocked. Okay, let me get something here. Okay, we got the Five of Swords energy here. Let me get something with the Five of Swords. And we got the Two of Swords. It's like, damn, I was excited at the beginning. It just sucked the damn life out of me. What just happened? Like, this shit is being blocked. It's like somebody's trying to hand something over, but it just, it seems like there's like some factors or something like that like okay let me get something here because the only major arcana is the lover's card that's something that's major arcana that's something that you cannot control okay that's the only major arcana out here is the lover's card there is a relationship that's supposed to be coming in it's supposed to be something that balances something out but it's like being shut down okay let me get something it's being shut down but somebody's still trying to they're still trying to make it work they're like, why is this shit blocked? I'm wondering the same damn thing. Because it seems to be a blessing. Why would a blessing come out here and then get blocked like that? What is that about? Like somebody's shutting something down. I'm telling you, it's something about words or something that somebody's saying. They're putting some type of energy out there. I don't know. I don't know. I might hear somebody like chanting or some shit like that. They need to get the fuck up out of here with that. Okay? It's something here like that. They doing something here to take this shit away from you. Wow. How dare the energy change on me like that? I was like, oh shit, somebody about to get that relationship. Nah, they trying to take that shit. We have the Six of Cups energy here. See, this is a past life relationship. I know I just got this kind of energy in another reading. I'm like, this is a blessing that's trying to come in. They're trying to, they're trying to swipe that shit. They're trying to, hmm. Okay, let me get something here. Let me calm on down. <laughs> Because they trying to take some shit. That shit ain't fair. Don't put the Ace of Pentacles and the Lovers out here and then throw the Ten of Sword. Okay? That's messed up. See, we got the Seven of Sword here, man. They trying to do... Oh, Lord. I'm screaming for somebody. They're trying to do everything they can so you can't rise. Because they know if you team up with this energy, you're going to rise. You're going to rise. You're going to rise if you team up with this energy. I don't know what the energy is. I don't know who it is. I don't know what it is. But it's something with you and another person. If you and this other person come together, you're good. You're good. Let me get something here with this Ten of Swords. Oh my goodness. We have the Empress energy here. See, they trying to cancel the Empress. I don't know who the Empress is, but they don't want the Empress to have this relationship. They trying to cancel this Empress so bad. Let me get something here with this Seven of Pentacles. Ooh, it's somebody conniving too. Damn, it's somebody conniving. Six of Cups could be like past life, past relationship childhood somebody that you know you grew up with it's somebody here we have the knight of wands energy here okay fire sign here facing the empress okay wait a minute let me get something here because somebody been trying to do something a long time too something about seven we have the knight of cups energy it's like the love is blocked y'all i cannot i'm getting a headache the Knight of Cups is underneath the Nine of Wands. Like the Nine of Wands is an energy of like, you know, you can't get past it. It's something like you got to fight beyond or it's like you got to be real strong to get through that. And it's like somebody can't get through it. They trying to get that Knight of Cups. They trying to find that love. They're leading with love, but it's like they're blocked. And it was the Emperor at the... <laughs> oh my God. Let me get something here with this Five of Swords. I cannot believe how this is coming out here like this. Like, how could they do something like this? I'm telling you, some people are motherfucking like, 
everybody is not the same, man. Everybody is not the same. I don't know how they're doing this. I don't know. Like, the first thing I was going to say, I really didn't want to say it, but the first thing I was going to say was, like, witches. Like, because this does not make no sense how something... <sighs> I don't know how the fuck they're doing it, y'all. I don't know how they're doing that shit. Some people got that shit, man, and they crazy. And it's like, a lot of times, if somebody can do that shit to you, it's it's kind of, in some kinds of ways, it's because you did something to them, whether it's in a past life or this life. If somebody has that kind of power... It's because something something happened to them that was fucking wrong and they came to get their fucking justice and they have the power to do the shit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm not trying to say that about nobody. Like, I'm really not, but I got to be real right now. Like, sometimes, it's not everybody, but sometimes it's because maybe you did something that you weren't supposed to do. Of course, you don't remember, but you may have done something in your past life. Maybe you took this person's lover. Maybe you did. I don't know. I hate the fact that it could be like that, but I just got to let somebody know because this shit right here is crazy. Then we got the Nine of Pentacles energy here. It's underneath the Five of Sword. Okay, let me get something here. Let me get something with this Two of Sword. Because this is where somebody is trying to, like, figure out. Okay, so we... Okay, wait a minute. We got the Nine of Cups. I mean, the Knight of Cups, the Nine of Pentacles, and the Six of Wands. So somebody does get through it. Oh, my God. Thank goodness. Woo! Somebody's going to get through it. You're going to get through the gate. Where I said that Nine of Wands is, like, really strong and you got to fight your way through that, there is something where you can get through it. And they're going to be confused about the shit because they know what they did. Ooh, I'm about to throw these cards at their head. They know what they did. They know what they did. They know what they did. They're not confused about the shit. They know exactly what they did. And that's why they're going to be surprised. Like, how the fuck is this person, like, getting the Nine of Pentacles and shit? Because I had blocked them. I had blocked this, this, that, and the third. That's what they know. Okay. Let me get something here with this Six of Cups. Mm-hmm. Okay. The Eight of Sword. Y'all... Stop playing. Stop playing. They're trying to trap somebody. They got somebody. I don't know. They got somebody in the freezer. They got somebody in a jar. They got somebody. I'm telling y'all what I know. I'm not making none of this shit up. That's what the fuck they're doing. That's what they're doing to stop somebody's either money or a relationship, a contract, something here. It's a relationship that's meant to help you ascend. It's two people that come together and it creates balance. I don't know what it is, but they're trying to do everything they possibly can so you cannot do this shit. And this is targeting an empress here. And we've seen the emperor, but he has not come out. He was at the bottom of the deck. So you know that's, that's what they're trying to do. But they're trying to target the root. They're trying to target the root, okay? That's the ace of pentacles that came out first. They're definitely trying to target the root. We got the four of pentacles. And we got the eight of wands energy here. You see, this is a focused energy on somebody's security. I'm telling you, it's like they... <sighs> This is the kind of energy, like, they're not going to attack your couch that you're sitting on, but they're going to attack the ground that the couch is sitting on, okay? It's a little bit deeper than that. I'm trying to tell somebody. It's like they're attacking the roots, okay? Or this person is using roots. Look, the karma going to be mad. Don't be mad at me. Let me get something here with this Seven of Swords energy. We got the chariot energy here. Okay, something, it's also something about fucking with somebody's transportation or fucking with somebody's car, fucking with somebody's future or the direction that somebody's going. They're trying to misalign something. They're trying to mess the direction. I'm trying to tell you. It's something about your crown, your head, okay? Something about uh, what you think, what you feel, and what you do, it must be aligned. That's discipline. Self-control here, something about self-control. But it's like they putting, they fucking with somebody's car. Like they fucking with somebody's vehicle. Like, okay, read between the lines. Like they fucking poking holes in your tires right now, okay? They putting cracks in the window shit, window sill and shit. Like they doing shit, okay? They putting sugar in the tank and all types of shit. But they may not be physically for real doing this shit, but it's like read between the lines. They're doing something to your vehicle. So your shit don't run straight. And you got to go to a fucking mechanic. You hear? You heard? Let me get something here with this empress. Taurus, Libra, energy also. We don't have that many major arcana here. We got the lovers, the empress, and the chariot. Because that's the direction you're supposed to go. It's something here. Like, they trying to take some type of counterpart. Like, why are they trying to take this from somebody? We have the eight of pentacles here. Yeah, this is somebody's career. This is somebody's skill, somebody's talent. Okay? This is where somebody is headed. They literally have somebody surrounded in some kind of way. Like, where they can't move or their car don't work or some shit. We got judgment here. So, it's time to wake up. It's time to wake up to what's going on here with this damn Knight of Wands. I don't know what kind of Knight of Wands you got in your life, but that motherfucker don't like you, okay? They do not like you. They are fired up, okay? They are really trying to attack somebody. This is their mission. This is their life mission, and they ain't going to stop. Seven of Pentacles. They're going to keep trying until they see fruit, but not, they're not going to see the fucking fruit. I know that they're not going to see the fruit because I see that Five of Swords. They're going to be confused 
as to how you're in that Nine of Pentacles energy because it's right underneath that Five of Swords. They're going to be very confused. Very confused. Let me get something here with this Knight of Cups. Mm-mm-mm. We have the King of Wands energy here. Okay, fire sign. Or maybe this is you taking charge of your energy or something like that because they are the master of energy and they don't lose. Or maybe it's something about Michael, Archangel Michael. Because judgment and, our, and the King of Wands, yeah, and he's facing judgment. So it could be an angel of fire or something like that for real. I don't know. You might need to call that in, get you a candle or something. We have the Page of Cups energy here. Hmm, Page of Cups energy is somebody that's innocent. Somebody that's childlike. Somebody that they have a, how can I say, they have a desire to connect. Could be artistic. Somebody has like high hopes. Maybe it's faith. Could be. Let me get something here. And then we got the Two of Cups here. Yes. Ooh, the Karmics is going to be motherfucking mad. Because they thought they took that shit way over here. They thought they took it way over here. And it's all the way over here. Right here with that Six of Wands. That's somebody's victory. They're going to be so confused. What are they going to be confused about? Justice? I'm telling y'all. That shit is out here, man. <laughs> I don't even care. That shit is out here. They going to be mad because they be trying it. Y'all don't even know how they be trying it. Oh, my God. The Six of Cups again. It's like this person stays in your energy, y'all. Almost put this deck to the side because I'm like, nah, they trying to come out here, too. Okay, let's see what the Six of Cups is leading to. Let me get something with this chariot. Mm -mm -mm. We got the Three of Wands energy here. Okay, so it looks like open roads when it comes to some type of Six of Cups or them. Okay, what is this? Because we got two Six of Cups out here. Now we got the Two of Wands. So I went from the Three of Wands to the Two. So it's like maybe somebody got to, they're going to like rechart. Like they were waiting on their ships to come in, but now they got to redo some shit or they got to rethink some shit or they got to re... Look, it went from the three to the two. So somebody had to take a step back. Okay, somebody got blocked. You see how this first one, there's no barrier in the three of wands, but in this one there is. There's a barrier right there. And it went from the three where there was no barrier to this. So, and that's after the six of cups. I'm telling you, it's somebody from the past that they thought that that shit was about to open up and now that shit got blocked. Elevator door is closing. Let me get something here with this judgment card. We have the Hierophant here. Lord, spiritual law, spiritual law. They about to get called. Somebody going to call them to the upper room. They going to tell them, like, don't do that. That's not right. That's not fair. Hierophant not supposed to be under judgment. Let me get something here with this. That's because you was doing something wrong. Hierophant get held to a higher standard. I don't know who this person is. We have the King of Pentacles here. Earth sign here, perhaps? I don't know. I hope this is in the favor. Well, I don't know. After it went to the Two of Wands, it's like somebody got to like learn a few more lessons or something like that. Because it's not... I feel like this is talking about whoever this is that's doing this to you. Like, I feel like somebody does have some type of spiritual gift or something like that. I really do. But I feel like they're abusing it. Okay? That's what I'm getting here. I don't know if it's a fire sign or an earth sign. But they're definitely abusing it. Yeah, the star. Let me get something here. Aquarius energy. And then we have seven of cups energy. It's like something that's very foggy here. And I don't know who it is that can't see through or they're not going to be able to see through something. They're not going to be able to affect something. They're not going to see the relationship. They're not going to see the union, the contract. It's something they're not going to be able to see because it's like you're chosen in some kind of way. And it's like, I feel like, I feel like everybody got their own, like, different gifts in this situation, but I just feel like they're using theirs to actually, like, harm you, okay? And then we got the Two of Swords at the bottom. Let me get something here. It's like there's some type of confusion. Here we go with that Eight of Wands that look like some type of attack. It's like you can't attack blood. I, I have to tell somebody that. You can't attack blood. Like, you should not attack blood. I don't know if this person is blood or whatever, but that's one thing because they are part of your bloodline. Like, you, sh you really shouldn't do that. You know, I'm just saying. Maybe that's for somebody. If this is not blood, well, you got somebody from the past that's attacking your ass. I'm telling you. And you may not see it. We Look, and I just said you may not see it. And look how that, that four cups is just floating in the sky and they don't even see it. Let me get something here. I feel like somebody's ignoring spirit. Don't ignore spirit. Spirit is trying to warn you. We have the hermit card Virgo energy here. Somebody cloaked, their energy cloaked, like covered up or something like that. And then it's somebody that's like gaining wisdom. They're watching something. They're looking at something, trying to get the insight, maybe learning something or maybe seeing that thing that they're missing. Like, cause I feel like somebody's being attacked from like a, I don't think it's an unknown source. I just think it, they're doing it in mysterious ways and somebody might need to start catching on to that shit. 
I'm just being real with somebody. We got the Ace of Cups energy here. Okay, we got something about healing. Okay, wait a minute. We got Death. We got the World card and the Three of Pentacles here. It's going to be the end of some type of cycle. This is, okay, wait a minute. Because this is a Hierophant and I see the Ace of Cups, This there's something also about a Hierophant healing. A Hierophant uh, connecting something or, or, or something about the Heart Chakra. Nah, this is healing. This is from the Divine. This is from the divine. And that's funny because this hermit is looking at that four cups. And the hermit, it's like, they're okay, the four cups has that cup that's floating that the person doesn't see. And they're looking into that. And they're about to realize this is some type of cup. They're about to see something. They're about to realize something here. Because it's a death card, the world card, and the three of pentacles. Something here is about to come together. It's about to be a, a working resource. It's about to be functioning. It's about to be usable. Or something here about a teamwork or something like that. Like, this, the old cycle is closing. Like, that shit is over. I feel like somebody has been blocked from, like, relationships or contracts. Something like that. Contract. I don't know what it is, but it's a union that's meant to help you. And I just got this energy. Let me get something here with this King of Pentacles. Nah, this is someone. And even judgment is about freedom. I, I saw it as imprisonment. And that's why I said there's somebody that's spiritual, but they're not doing the right thing. But it could be both sides of it. Maybe there is another energy that is doing the right thing. And they're causing freedom. Because the Ace of Cups is underneath the Hierophant. You can't read that bad. There's something here about that energy that is healing. Or maybe it's the relationship that brings you healing. We got the 10 of wands energy here. Oh, that's the energy of like really giving your all to something. Really giving your all. Like it could really be exhausting. And then we got the world card. Like if somebody got to fight to close the cycle out fighting to close the cycle out because they're a chosen one here they are a star they are different they they do have a purpose here yeah something about balancing let me get something here with this seven of cups and then we got the hangman seeing something from a whole different light here surrendering to the uncomfortable surrendering to the circumstance not denying what you see or trying to act like it's not uncomfortable hmm what is this? And it's the high priestess at the bottom. Stop playing. Y'all know. Whoever this is, you know what I'm saying. You know every word I'm saying right here. And you know that you, I don't know. It's something here. Either you got to protect yourself. I see doors opening, but I don't think it's going to come from nothing because I see the Ten of Wands. I feel like it's going to be hard. Somebody's going to be exhausted trying to get some type of fucking curse or something, some type of spell work or some shit because I'm telling you, they're blocking that shit from the third card. They canceled that shit. I was excited from the first two cards and they canceled that shit on the third card. Nah, man. Don't let them do that shit. Let me get something here with this. Nah, they playing. It says diamond. Somebody here is gonna be strong as hell. It says invincible spiritual power. Yeah, somebody need to pay attention, man. It says cat. Okay, disinterested, aloof, my way or the highway. Cool cat, unaffected, not my problem. Yeah, somebody gonna be all right. And it says symphony. And I was getting something about that Three of Pentacles and, and working together, teamwork, co-creating, collaborating here. It says display, organization, lead, follow, precise, contribute. Let me get something here. Collaborate. It says autumn. That's where we're headed. It also says full moon. It says olive branch, truce, surrender, giving in, coming to terms. Okay, de-escalate, make amends, peace offering. Let me get something here. And it says blinders, victim mentality. Somebody is not, look, it might be somebody that's just never going to stop, y'all. Like, I'm, I'm telling y'all, it's somebody that's just never going to stop. They just never going to stop. You might even reach out something about an olive branch. They don't want that shit. They do not want that shit. It says victim mentality, confusion, tunnel vision, resist clarity, confirmation bias, restriction, narrow focus, echo chamber, denial, oblivious, out of touch. Okay, y'all get it. What's this at the bottom here? It says baby. <laughs> something about a baby. What's this at the bottom under that? It says crystal ball. And that's connecting to the high priestess. It's something about a child here. Something about a baby. I don't know. Maybe that's what that ace of pentacles is. I don't know. It says new beginnings here, rapid growth, fresh start, or it might not be a baby. It might just be about what new changes are going to come into your life. It says unlimited potential, innocent, continuing the legacy. Okay, new phase, birth of a child, vulnerable. It says seeing clearly. So it's something here you have to see. You have to, it says perception, sixth sense, divination, future planning, gut reaction, inner knowing. It's something where you can't deny that shit, man. You can't deny that shit. Because sometimes shit just be like weird. It be off or it be like you got to pay attention. 
and be like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I'm getting that kind of energy. And really, I, I truly feel like it's somebody doing something here to stop a relationship or a manifestation or a child or something from growing here. But when you catch on to that shit and you realize your power because the star is here, if you realize that shit, when you realize that shit, things are going to change here. Things are going to change. This person ain't net. Mm. I don't want to say never. I don't want to say never. But from what I'm seeing here, I saw Olive Branch, but then I saw Blinders. So I'm like, they don't want they don't want no truth or nothing like that. I mean, you can try. You can try. I'm just saying. But I'm going to leave it right here. Actually, no. What am I talking about? Where is this angel message at? Wait, let me get one of these messages here. Matter of fact, I need a I need an ancestor message too. It says, let it be. Yeah, it says, if you need to solve a problem, ask yourself, what is the simplest way to proceed? When you call forth the simplest path, it appears and vice versa. Okay, it says, without agenda, pure love and everything you have dreamed will happen when you are ready to give love without expecting anything in return. True givers receive. <sighs> but it just feel like some shit was blocked out here. And it says, raise the bar. Okay. Let me get something here with the ancestor message. It says, Book of Psalms. Somebody need to crack open that book. I know you got a Bible somewhere up in there. Let me get something here with this. Wait, I dropped the card. What does it say? It says, Cursed, but it was in reverse. Woo, child. Ooh. I don't even read this shit in reverse. I don't read these cards in reverse. But the way that I picked it up, this shit is woo. You about to break that shit up off of you. You about to break that shit up off. You better pray that shit up off. You say book of Psalms and the curse is in reverse. You about to break that shit up off. You. I'm trying to tell somebody. Somebody need to know. This shit ain't right. It says bay leaves. Something about bay leaves. You, about, you, you better look that shit up. You better boil that shit. Okay. You better put that shit in a bath or something like that. I don't know. Put some bay leaf and cinnamon. I don't know. You better. Hey, you better look at some ingredients or something for real. It says black magic. You need to do something with bay leaves. There's so many things you could do with some bay leaves. I don't care what you do. You want to chew on some, make some damn tea, rub that shit. I don't care what you want to do, but it's here. Book of Psalms, you need to pray. You need to find the strength within the word. Get that shit up off of you. And it says, yes. Throw in the cards. Oh, but then it says, no. <laughs> let me pull one more card here. I don't even care about no. Let me, let me get something here. What is it saying no to? Because we definitely got yes out here. And yes and no is an energy of yin and yang. It's like balance here. Okay? Just pointing that out before I pull the card. There is an energy of balance here. Okay, let me get something here. And it says high priestess. Let me get something with the high priestess. And we got will of fortune. See, they don't want that shit to happen. Man, they don't want that shit to happen. This is what they don't want. You're about to get all this shit because the first card, it said yes to all of this shit with the curse and shit being reversed. It said yes. But the no is this is what they don't want. High Priestess, Wheel of Fortune, and the Nine of Pentacles. Mm -mm, that shit is yours, though. But I'm going to leave it right here. If you like the way that I read, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes. I truly appreciate it because it is how we get the messages out in order to elevate the collective. I love you guys, and I'll be back with another reading later. Bye.